Hi, it's Richard from Ignite Growth, and I just thought I'd touch on sales training for a minute. Uh, sales training is something that I see a lot of businesses, and when I go in and work with clients on a consultancy basis, um, I often talk to them about how regularly their sales team are updated, how regularly they do training, how regularly they do role plays, things like that. Uh, because it's something that I see a lot of, and a proper sales professional will be constantly updating their knowledge because they know the world around them is changing you know the platforms that they're using are constantly changing you know now a lot of sales teams are using video using video to outreach to people uh, on email there's a whole video marketing piece on how to engage with your um, prospects using video that's something that's become really huge over the last year but a lot of sales teams still aren't using it they're still not embracing using video in their email outreach okay so a lot of these things are driven by how the buyers behavior is changing so the way they research online the way they ask questions the way they do their own research on you as a business you know a lot of this is changing constantly just with technology the way social media changes the way technology changes the way we all use the internet i think these are real key things that salespeople who no matter how good they are should be constantly ke keeping up to date with you know i did a video on sales enablement and had a lot of questions coming from that video about how to align marketing and sales to work together so that sales could be more effective you know they could be more efficient sell more efficiently and at velocity so that's really the key to increasing your sales and hitting those increasing sales targets that you're setting for yourself and the revenue and customer acquisition piece. So it is constantly changing in the modern world. And I think the answer to that is to constantly be training your sales team. So finding different companies who can bring in sales training and just making sure that they're as sharp as possible. And if you're the owner of the business and you're still out selling on the road, you know, are you doing every six months some sales training? You know, again, it's there's plenty of ways to access sales training, but it really amazes me because you, if you were a, a professional salesperson, you would constantly want to be updating. You know, the CPD for nearly every other um, organization where you are expected to keep your knowledge and keep your skills uh, increasing every year and you get CPD points um, for lawyers, for solicitors, uh, doctors as well. You know, you wouldn't want to go into a doctor who'd done training 15 years ago and had never done any training since then, would you? And again, it's the same with salespeople. You know, you see salespeople who were, you know, oh yeah, I had some training 10 years ago and that's about the 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 whole um, the whole scope of what their training has been. So again, think of this as an important element in your customer acquisition because it is. It's super important that your sales team are bang up to date with the latest sales techniques, but they also realise that they have to talk to their buyers in a different way. They have to understand their buyers and they have to understand where they are in that buyer's journey when they're first engaging with buyers because they're far far further on now that 70 percent of the way down their buying decision before a salesperson ever talks to them so they'll already have knowledge and it's up to your sales team then to give them that additional knowledge to make the right decision for them so again sales training is a key part of that so take it seriously make sure you reach out to people uh, if you ever want any advice from me, I've got four or five really good sales trainers that I've worked with, so I'm happy to always pass those on to people. Um, so as I say, just make sure you take this seriously because it will make a huge difference to your customer acquisition, how many deals you land, but the value of those deals and also the long-term relationship because if the selling part is done right, you will often find that people, uh, customers and clients will stay with you far longer and uh, be far more loyal as well in the future. All right, so that's really a key thing I just wanted to share in a video. All right, take care and I'll talk to you soon. And remember, if you haven't subscribed yet to the channel, make sure you click the uh, icon down here and that'll bring up the subscribe link, tap on that. And then also hit that bell icon as well. So you activate your notifications and you're notified of any new vid videos that I upload. All right, take care, bye now.